planet of the fakes. And. Pig Star HH News. Disclaimer. For awareness and educational purposes only. It took the Netflix cuties controversy to awaken us to a very serious issue, buried underneath the left's favorite taglines love is love and asylum is a human right, a much more sinister movement is growing, the normalization of pedophilia. Wilkow argues that of course, the truth is branded as a crazy conspiracy theory, the people it exposes are the very people who control the dominant narrative, what's scary is that only a few short years ago this idea, that those in higher office would slowly try and change our world opinion, on the topic of pedophilias was thought a conspiracy at the time. Now that we see experts trying to rationalize it and make it not a crime is mind-blowing, but here we are witnessing it as Epstein's Island trial continues and many of our wealthiest are being caught some to be named soon. So flipping the script and downplaying this is disgusting. Immoral, wrong. There is no other view. Some things will always be wrong. Davina Knight this is what I'm trying to tell these people. And I don't know why I'm not trying to single them out, but Democrats and liberals do not seem to get it wrong to stand, or they do and they just turn a blind eye to the facts, which in my mind makes it look like they agree with the article that people are just sick and need help. Well I think they need therapy before they start doing you because if they think it's okay, and just a sickness or hereditary, there is something majorly wrong with their outlook on life morals, values honesty parenting and humanity, all of these people in high places with power and money, are trying to get the law changed I don't care how much money they have though it won't change and if it does them people that get away with it will not live to see the inside of a hospital and if they do they won't live long enough make it from the hospital back home. Not if it was my kid God bless, you have a wonderful day this is absolutely sick, protect our children. The Lord says protect the children. He said to them, let the little children come to me, and do not hinder them, for the kingdom of God belongs to such as these. Truly I tell you, anyone who will not receive the kingdom of God like a little child will never enter it. And he took the children in his arms, placed his hands on them and blessed them, children need protection. We live in a world corrupted by evil. God is our deliverer from trouble and enemies and we should protect kids from people who seek their harm as an extension of our love for him. This is hard to believe, where is proper parental guidance? It seems like the parents are exploiting him, or they have a screw loose. Louise Foutsberg 800,000 children go missing every year. Very few of them are ever found. Is this the reason more wasn't done to locate them? President Trump is trying to find these children and the Democrats and Hollywood and other pedophiles are scared. I saw a video of a woman, college professor who is going around to universities giving speeches on the normalization and acceptance of pedophilia. This is sick, sick, sick. We need to start fighting back, for the sake of our children and for the children of others it's hard to believe this is true. Half of me wants to dismiss it as a conspiracy theory, and the other half wants to sound an alarm. Either way, could 2020 get any more bizarre really? This is just sick. There is no way to justify sexual actions with children or infants by adults or even teens. Enough with this nonsense. Call it what it is. Sick. Those who choose this are seriously mentally sick. And should not be given a pass by claiming it's not their fault or how they're wired. Sickening. Connie Quavel and Pure Evil. Andrew Weirich. Too many things are accepted because it is chalked up to the luck of the draw or mental illness. Are we now going to be forced to accept yet another aberration? Enough. People think this is a joke. It's so vile and beyond what they show on media because it's true a lot of it is hard to handle considering we have all been conditioned. Once I started reading, listening, searching it really threw me for a loop, but I allowed my mind to unblock my beliefs and open my eyes and ears. We have to protect our country, our children, our families and stand for the man that has been fighting against so many. Pray for him. Trump 2020. Thank you very 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 much. Go to www dot ammer